it's more small brook fishing for me today. First cast, I'm in a very nice looking spot indeed. Deeper water on a bend and I've just caught, as you can see, a roach. At least I'm not a blanker. My 11th session of the year and I've yet to encounter a blank. And no sooner did the bait hit the deck on my second cast, another roach. As you can see, not big if we were talking the River Severn or other such venues, nothing to shout about, but on a brook like this, I tell you what, I'm happy camper indeed. I'm very impressed with this spot because, lively fish, probably never been caught before, third cast and it's another nice roach. I've just cast out again. The bait settled. Let's see if it's four on the bounce. This won't produce many fish because it's a tight swim. So once it begins to exhaust itself, the fish will spook very easily, of course. I'll move on somewhere else or sometimes I'll just move on because the nature of this type of fishing, for me personally, I don't have any brooks on my doorstep, so I do have to travel. So what I will invariably do is put a small amount of tackle in the boot of the car. I'm on the way to work, for example. I'll do a little bit of fishing, 20 minutes, then I'll be on my way. It's all about making the most of every opportunity and fitting in as much as you can into the 24 hours that we all have in each day. It went quiet as it does. I was thinking about moving on and then I just caught the fourth, <laughs> another lively 